the Eastern Conference Semifinals, Game 1. The 76ers are coming in off an arduous seven-game battle in Round 1. The intensity has been heightened. The stakes raised. They are now in the hunt for a Game 1 victory against Charlotte. The opening game of the Conference Semifinals, up next. All right, as you know, we closed out the Cleveland Cavaliers in four games last episode, completing the sweep in round one, moving on to round two, and I had a 30-point, 16-assist game on 50% efficiency from the field and 6 for 9 from 3. Nice. And I got a lot of help from the Mellow Ball and DeAndre Ayton, a little help from Rozier off the bench with 13. Uh, my computer has an update. That's awesome. Uh, Aiton gave us a 20-20 game. Missed one shot all game. That is his best game of the playoffs. These are his playoff stats, by the way. Uh, Lamella Ball also had his best game of the series. 28 points and 12 assists. Did not shoot well from three, but that's fine. He has been struggling from the field all series. But now he's got his splits up to 15-35. I'll take it. And for this series, I did hold Donovan Mitchell to 19 points a game on 31% from the field and 26% from three. For a bona fide, legit playoff performer like Donovan Mitchell, that's amazing. That just shows how good my defense is, and I'm going to need it going into this round two. And here is the stats. I said I wouldn't forget this time to put in the stats. Percentage 2K. Here is everything. I'm going to hit accept, and we do get, we are up to 83,000 XP. And if you don't know, I do my upgrades at the end of the season. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Cedric's gonna be a baller next season, but I think I'm gonna mainly put all my um, attributes into these badges. And I did make a lineup change. I did bring Nick Richards off the bench because him or Aiden playing power forward, they're not gonna be able to keep up with Tobias Harris. So I slid Jeremy Grant back to the power forward. We'll see how he does. And I'm gonna trust Lamelo Ball guarding James Harden. I'm gonna guard Tyrese Maxey. And hopefully Aiton can slow down at least Joel Embiid. And if you're curious, these are the sliders we are working with in game one. As you know, I up the CPU all the way up to 72, 68. Like, this is beyond Hall of Fame. Hall of Fame has it all on 55 or 65, something like that. And mine is on 45, which is Hall of Fame sliders on 45. I did up my 3.6x to 55 instead, so my teammates could hit more threes. Uh, but yeah, those are the sliders we're working with. Anyways... Let's get into this game against the Sixers. Here we are in Charlotte. We actually have home court advantage for this series. We have the same exact record as the Sixers, but we did own the tiebreaker. So the second round runs through Charlotte. This is interesting. The 6 and 7 seed going at it for a chance to head to the conference finals. I don't remember when the last 7 or 6 seed actually made it to the conference finals. Maybe I'll look it up. Maybe I won't. You would have wanted to be. We'll be getting minutes, I believe, in the series, but that is Lamelo Ball stats on the season. Yeah, yeah, all right, see it. Let's get it going. Philly, Charlotte, Aiton versus Embiid, Cedric versus Maxi, Lamelo versus Harden, Big Three versus Big Three. This matchup is very solid as long as Aiton and Lamelo can hold their guys for long enough. And the X factor in this series will probably be Tobias Harris on if. Oh, and B's going to get an easy shot. Nope, I'm going to have to leave the three open right there. And Maxie's going to knock it down. But, uh, yeah, Ty um, Tyrese. Tobias Harris is going to be the X factor in this series for the Sixers, I believe. If he can cook against um, Jeremy Grant and get some buckets, it's going to be huge for them as LaMelo fouls. Great. Fast break. Give me the ball, please. I'm going to pull this. I'm pulling up for... Th Yikes. That was good defense, but never mind. Never mind. Apparently, it wasn't good defense by Aiton. This game has been very bad for me. Why are you passing that, Lamelo? Give that back. Yeah, I wanted you to set the screen, man. So I can... I'm like two for seven. Let me get some shots up. That... that oh, and yeah, and you took the shot. And you yeah, air ball. We'll, we'll call that a pass. Oh, Aiton, that's a wide open dunk. Don't screw it. Oh, thank you. Bryce Harris, that was a great steal, Aiton. Give it to me. Give it to me. You guys suck. You guys suck, and I missed the shot. You got to be kidding me. And I'm leaving him open. That is no way that's going in. Thank you. You're going to pass the ball to me? Nope, just throw it on the other side of the court. It's all right. I'm not wide open. It's fine. It's fine. Yep, Terry Rozier. Yeah, you do what you got to do. I'm pulling that. That's going to be a brick, ain't it? Yep. Uh, Brandon Boston, please. You're wide open, man. Thank you. Tie game. Embiid. 
What is he gonna post it? There ain't no way that goes it. You got to be kidding me. I okay, I paused. He, he missed anyways. I just got stopped. Jeremy Grant, give me the ball. Your ass, your ass. You're not touching the ball. Right to the paint. And Embiid's there. Great. Dude just magnetizes to the paint. No matter where he is on the court. Dude's got super speed. Aiden comes set the screen. I'd give it to Razier for him to set a screen, but we all know what he's going to do. Aiden, that's an easy bucket for you. Thank you. You've been the only offense on this team so far. I left him wide open, and he hit it. I need to stop doing that. I don't trust my teammates. I, I don't. I don't trust my teammates on defense. They're just going to give up easy shots, and I end up being the one giving up easy shots. Aiden is just missing easy shots. You got to be kidding me. And he... I love how he holds on to the ball there. But if that's my teammates, it's like there's a trampoline on their hands. They immediately lose the ball. It's fa it's a fascinating to me. Fascinating. Apparently, I just can't let my guy open up. Aiden. You hit it. I'm not going to complain. You had Grant right open in the corner. You wouldn't have hit it. But I don't know how you hit that shot. Give me that. That's a yoink. That's a yoink. On the cut. Nick Richards, keep cutting. That's an easy dunk. Man, if I'm going to be 2 for 12, I'm going to get about 20 assists. Oh, no, this is you're in the game. Let's get my let's get my three pointers up. Let's get my three pointers up. There we go. That's the second one of the game. Let's, yeah, three for thirteen. I shot twenty five percent in that first quarter. Oh my god! Right, I'm cutting. I'm cutting. You, you, what are you doing, Yuda? Why did you throw a lot? Oh my god! First of all, Lamel should have passed that to me when I called for it wide open in the paint. And second of all, why would Yuda throw a lob? What are you doing? I got McDaniels on. That's a good move right there by Cedric, and that's a dunk. Finally get a shot going. We're up by one. Sixers will hold until the last shot. 15 seconds left. The fact that we have a lead with me playing as poorly as I am is fascinating. I am like 4 for 16, I believe. Reggie Bullock is cold. I still won't leave him open. I left him open, but I'm going to get the steal. Lamella, it doesn't matter. Quarter's over. We are up by one, heading into halftime. Oh, where the hell did we get team takeover? All right. Well, I know Aiton has 17 points to hit Lamelo. I got. I hate you. I hate you. Lamelo's got not Lamelo. Aiton's got 17 points and 10 rebounds right now. So yeah, he's balling out. Oh, Tobias played that perfectly, but not good enough. Oh, that's not going in. It. It is going in. It doesn't need to be green. Cedric Lewis starting off the quarter. One for one from three. But just clean slate. Clean slate. One for one now in this game. Not four for 17. Oh, Harden's wide open, and he's going to answer back. Right here, Lamelo, Back. I'm answering right back, Harden and I. Who, all right, who's going to hit the three for them next? Who's going to hit the three for them next? I shot 27% from the field that last half. Not a, Nope, not this half. We're, I'm going off. We're winning this game. It's been competitive enough. Harden for three. Can he match it? He does not. I win that battle. I'm going to sub out here. We have a five-point five lead. Uh, Aiton is absolutely dominating Joel Embiid right now. And we have a one-point lead. Okay, then. I guess our bench isn't as effective against the Sixers. And Aiton turned the ball over before the last shot of the game. I'm there. No foul. What defense by Cedric Lewis. Got the last shot. Uh, Come set the screen. Nick Richards now. Come set the screen now. Uh, Cut to the basket. That's an easy layup. And he hits it. Last shot of the quarter gives the Hornets the lead heading into the fourth. And we got ourselves a game here, 79 to 81. And we have Aiton. Tobias on Aiton, bro. This, that should be easy buckets for Aiton. There you go. Aiton is the only reason why we are even in this game right now. Bro, that's wild. That How does that go in? Aiton, I'm saying you the screen now, bud. The turns. Now the turns have table. DeAndre in with another layup. He's got 28. And I have not been playing good defense on Tyrese Maxey. My lord. Well, we were maintaining a four-point lead this entire quarter until D'Anthony Metlin decided to hit a three. Bro, I can't hit nothing right now. I I just don't know my release right now. I'm going to keep trying, though. I'm going to keep trying because if this game, game comes down to it, LaMelo Ball, nice layup. If this game comes down to it, I need to be the one to take the shot. I'm not trusting any of my teammates unless it's Aiton in the paint. I do not trust any of my teammates with a jump shot. Fast break. Guy, give me the ball here. You have to. I'm going straight at Tyrese Maxey. And he fouls. 119 left. That's a huge 
foul for Tyrese Maxey. I had to go at him. This is where I'm getting a majority of my points at the free throw stripe. And I have still yet to miss a single free throw in these playoffs. Five point game. A minute left. Anthony Melton bringing up the ball. James Harden not in the game for the Sixers. They're going to go straight to Embiid. And they turn the ball over. What are we going to do? Pass it to LaMelo is what we're going to do. And then kick it back to me. Kick it back to me. Kick it back to me. Let's just waste time. What a turnover for the 76ers. DeAndre Ayton with the screen. And he's going to get an easy dunk. Easy lane to the basket. Hornets. Up by seven. Eaton's got 34 points in this game. Unbelievable turn of events. And that's a good switch. Embiid is going to have to play hero ball. Melton. I could have got the steal there, but I didn't want to risk it. Melton with the ball. They need a score here. Melton getting clamped up. Embiid hits a tough shot. Five-point game. 34 seconds left. Give the ball to me, and they're going to intentionally foul. And Sixers bring back Harden in for offense. And they do not take a timeout, which is smart. They still have the shot clock. They're probably going to go to Embiid, even though a three would be very valuable here. Embiid misses. Give the ball. They're not even going to foul. They're not even going to foul. I'm going straight to the... I don't... I still hit it. You know what? It is what it is. I thought I was going to get fouled there. They're not even going to foul. They waved the white flag. And the Charlotte Hornets are going to take game one. Of this Eastern Conference second round against the Sixers with a dominant fourth quarter. Give the ball to me. I just want to shoot it. Floater. I miss. All right. 101 110 is your final score for game one. We win by nine, even with the struggle of a game from Cedric Lewis. Final box score, Aiton. This he is the reason why we won this game. 34 points, 20 rebounds, two steals and two. Blocks missing five shots the whole night with three offensive rebounds. What a performance from DeAndre, and he has come alive here in Charlotte, showing his true form as the number one overall pick, outplaying Joel Embiid. Cedric Lewis, I did put up 32 points, six rebounds, 14 assists, and three steals, only one turnover. But man, what a tough shoot tonight! 10 for 28, four for 12. It's gonna happen. Uh, first half, I shot 4 for 15. That second half, I got a little bit better with 6 for 13, but just not a great game. Still have not missed a free throw in. Nick Richards, man. Even off the bench, he's still balling. 18 points off the bench, missing two shots. Our centers killed it. LaMelo Ball had a struggle of a game, but he still gave us 10 assists. And then everyone else did garbage. Yuta Watanabe will not be playing next game. I'll tell you that much right now. Maxi, I did not do my due diligence on defense this game. 24 points. I will make sure this man has a struggle next game. Jalen McDaniels, I almost said Jaden, with 20 points off the bench, hits three threes. Embiid, only 19 points. Not a good game for Joel Embiid. Only went to the line three times. Aiden was very disciplined when it comes to the fouls. Melton had 12 points. Harden had a struggle of a game and didn't even play most of that fourth quarter. And like I said, the X Factor Harris did nothing. Six points. That's going to be for me. GG.